Captain, we just received a letter from Madam Lulu, summoning us to... Lulu? Asking us for help? She must be in a stinking heap of trouble. Aye, a rare quest. What you thinking? Must she ask? We had to. Chances to get leverage over Lulu. Don't say a bye often. Henry, are you sure Madame Lulu arranged to meet us here? It's been a while, and there's no sign of her. No need to fret, Betty, me lass. Ain't there a saying among you noble folk that arriving late be a lady's prerogative? Could changing the meaning place be a lady's prerogative too? Look there! Oh, is that a secret signal? This meeting might be more interesting than I thought. Keep your wits about you! The signal ends here, okay? See if there be any other clues. Hey, watch where you're walking. If you're using your eyes, I'll take them off you. Oh, you be picking the wrong fight, fella. Unless you be bored to live in. Tough guy, huh? <laughs> Come on, your heart is. Let's have it. Hey, these boots are brand new. Now look at them all scuffed. That will cost you some gold, or you earn living. How about to beat you till you see gold stars? Then you can count as much gold as you want!
if it ain't dear little Lulu. Don't worry. I'll finish off these troublemakers and... Spare me the chatter and come with me quickly. The rest of you can scatter. That performance should be enough. Aye, aye, boss. So those thugs were your crew? It'd be never straightforward with you. Your arrival will draw too much attention. Attention, you say? They do call me the infamous. Infamous for bringing disaster wherever you sail. Um, <clears throat> to business. You've gone to all this trouble to bring me here. Can't be just because you miss me. Or do I imagine? Actually, I'm just the messenger. An old friend of yours needs your help. You'll find him waiting for you. There was me thinking it was you need saving. Was looking forward to that reward. Keep dreaming, Henry. You can discuss your reward with the actual client.
Honey Coon, Betty Cha. Long time no liquor. Come. This barrel is not yet finished. That barrel's bigger than you are. How'd you drink all that? Tanaka always was a thirsty one. So he be the one looking for me. Watch out! Tuero! An ambush already! Would that be a warm welcome? Crew! Surround at seven! Forget it. That arrow carries no malice. And came from at least two hundred paces away. He won't catch her. Oh, you know who that was? Indeed. And that's why I discreetly seek your assistance. I understand you have experience in dealing with noble ladies. Hm. He certainly has experience of surviving, thanks to noble ladies. So some rich less from your homeland be giving you grief, huh? Your words are somewhat uncouth, but that's a gist. But when you say escorting you to my ship will make her appear, how so? Like that. Look out! Tanakasa, hand over the sacred treasure, or you won't leave here alive. Sacred treasure, you say? This be getting more interesting. Chizuru, you understand why your father gave the sacred treasure to me, do you not? I do. And that's why I'm reclaiming the sacred treasure now. Ah, such trouble. I pass this into your hands, Honeycoon. This is a matter I need your help with. No worries, I'll have this solved in a jiffy. Then we can talk about this treasure. This girl be as nimble as a bloody cat. How are we supposed to catch her? Chizuru's martial arts are superior to many a samurai. Catching her here is unlikely. So what's the plan? Our aim's too good. If we turn and leave, we'll be target practice. Do not. I prepared smoke bombs to cover us. Now! Can someone explain to me how our little deadly feathered friend caught up with us? Aye, something be off. 
It's almost as if she can sense our navigational course. <sighs> it seems we can't shake her. The bait. We can wait for her. Some matters must be faced in person. So, you be telling me your homeland? That is correct. Of the three treasures, the Jade Orb is in my possession. And the Heavenly Sword is with Tanaka. It turns out these three treasures are drawn to each other. No wonder you can look at us. I come to you because an Onimsha has appeared off the coast of our homeland. He is plundering all merchant ships in the waters. My lord has ordered me to attack him. But he possesses one of the three treasures, the Sacred Mirror. This makes the battle difficult. As he is the former retainer of my father, I need Tanaka to honor his duties of loyalty and help me defeat the Onimsha and regain the three treasures. It is true I serve the Sanada clan, and I understand my duty in assisting the orphan of my former lord. However, your father and brother died honorably in a battle loyal to the royal family. Yet now, you are working for the traitor who killed your father. My commitment as a samurai means I would fight the Onimusha to the death. But my integrity as a samurai prohibits me from working with the traitor. We need not meddle in this. Let us part ways. What's the deal? You spoke with such passion a moment ago. They be turning to me for help. My homeland is a thousand miles from here. I need Honeycomb's ship to return home. A thousand bleeding miles away? What makes you think I would do a thing like that? I thought... Based on our friendship. Friendship? I advise you not to place too much weight in that word. We'll still be pirates after all. But based on our friendship, and all the treasures the Onimusha has plundered, I believe the journey would be... Treasure, you say? You mean all that plundered merchant loot the bow and arrow girl mentioned earlier? The same. Instead of letting Chizuru take the treasures back to her traitor lord, I believe it would be better to use them to reward our friendship. I'm right you are. For a pirate, friendship be the most valuable thing. Give me a few days to prepare for the long voyage. Then we'll be on our way. For friendship!
May my music self your soul. Ha! Music vengeance. Get in line. May my music sell you. With beauty comes death.
فكري تنجي وقدمه أكا فيلي Everything you could want is here, friend. 